Hello, so today we are going to talk about adding audio into your HTML website. To do this, it'll be really simple. I'm going to real quick, I'm going to get rid of this stuff just so I can kind of start somewhat fresh. The tag we are going to be using is just audio. Uh, audio, I believe, is self closing. So we have it like. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're self closing. Thank you. <laughs> we're gonna go. We're gonna type in controls. Controls is a Boolean variable. It is automatically set to true. Then we, then we go. SRC for source equals. Then here's where we we'll type our source. Right now we don't have any source. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna go to a file explorer, whatever, explorer, whatever. Desktop. I'm gonna go my audio. That's where I have it stored. I just have a Silent Night. Audio I got from the YouTube music library or audio library. I'm just gonna drag it over here, and this pops up here. I don't need that. Go minimize that, and then I'll rename this to make it nice and easy to use. Silent night. So the source is going to be silent night dot mp3. If I reload this, that should have worked, but it doesn't because I probably don't know what I'm doing. Do that, and that works because I know what I'm doing. And it starts playing just like that. I can pause it, play it again, pause it, go around in it. This is a basic audio control. Now, there are other things that you can use. There's other attributes you can use, such as, for example, Autoplay. Now, before I type the Y in here, it will. Well, I don't believe it will yet. So, it, once I press the space, it will automatically stop playing the audio right when the site reloads. Just like that. I didn't even click it. Of course, you can pause it, but you don't have to. Another one you can do muted. So, by default, it starts muted. And you can nice and easily pause it, unmute. Play it again. And one more you can do is a loop. So at the end of it, it will automatically loop it if we wait a minute here. It should automatically stop playing again. Just like that. So there you have it. That is how you can include audio in your HTML document.